First, the Clark County School District officials come together to discuss incidents involving guns at schools and how to keep students and staff safe. And this afternoon, officials revealed another incident. Yesterday, a student at Desert Rose High School was arrested for bringing a loaded gun onto campus. And 13 Action News reporter Tom George has more on how the district hopes to tackle this issue. Well, counselors have been here all day and the community is still reeling from what happened here yesterday at Canyon Springs High School where a student was shot and killed just near the school. Now this marks the seventh case of a gun being brought to a campus at CCSD so far this year and it's enough to have administrators concerned. At a press conference today they announced they want to take some steps to try and change that and the biggest thing that they say they're doing is announcing a new advisory board that will be made up of principals, teachers, students and community leaders whose specific job it'll be to tackle this issue. It is clear that there is a problem. It is not our problem alone. This is a national problem and it's not one that we in the schools can solve by ourselves. Now when it comes to security, budget has also been a big issue. One thing that CCSD police say they are doing is while they're not bringing back a full fledged gang unit of their own, they say they will be assigning an officer from CCSD police to work with Metro's gang unit specifically to deal with the gang issue. Tom George, 13 Action News. Thank you.